the second stage in the Giro d'Italia Donna starts in Bagno a Ripoli, a normal quiet Italian town that is now transformed into a cycling fest. With the sun out and no rain, it promises to be a nice day on the bike. However, today's stage is going to be a hard one, with the Passo della Colla, a 16km climb with an average climbing percentage of 4.6%. Yeah, the climb is quite long, depending on how they will uh, do it, but yeah, for sure we like, I like uh, the, the course. I know that uh, I need to suffer a lot on the climb, then it will be really fast to the, to the finish line. We have a few cars to play, so we will see how the stage will go. Yeah, on the flat point uh, can be also good for breakaway. Uh, for sure, there will be people trying to attack also there because uh, in the end today is the first stage, so it's uh, open for everybody. And everybody wants uh, the pink, uh, so we will be smart and try to control when it's necessary, uh, and then we'll see what comes in the climb. 30 kilometers into the race, Irene Mendes and Susanna Andersen are taking their chance and break away from the peloton of the 102 kilometer stage to Maradi. Beatrice Pozzobon and Georgia Bariani are in the counter attack with the peloton, more than three minutes behind the two leaders who work well together. But as we get closer to the Passa della Colla, the two chases are caught. Now rain pours down again on the peloton. Luckily, it is a short rain shower and the race continues. When the climb towards the summit of Passa della Colla starts, the two breakaway riders are caught. With six kilometers to the summit, Annemiek van Fleuten attacks. Marta Cavalli, Mavi Garcia, Anna Santa Esteban, Elisa Longa Bogini and Gaia Realini follow 15 seconds behind the world champion. Cavalli and Realini are the only two riders who can follow the unleashed Dutch rider, but they cannot reach van Fleuten. Within the 4 km mark, the two are caught and a thinned out group of favorites rides hard to get Van Fleuten back. But she is on a pink mission and after an impressive solo, Annemiek Van Fleuten wins the second stage of the Giro d'Italia Donna. But actually it was more the plan today to reduce a bit uh, the people we had to look for. I was not expecting, I was expecting a group of 4 or 5, we have a bit like equal riders. If I look to the, uh, especially to the Vuelta, I felt like but also knew that I didn't know how my form is and uh, apparently I'm a bit better than uh, in the spring. Annemiek van Fleuten wins the second stage of the Giro d'Italia Donna. Cecily Utrup Ludwig is second, followed by Juliette Labous. Yeah, maybe some people were maybe have a bit double feeling that, I, that we have already so early the pink jersey. Uh, but then on the end is also, the goal was to make the group, we have to watch a bit more small and that I think is also, uh, we also succeeded with that. Annemiek van Vleuten is also the new leader in the general classification. Otto Ludwig is 49 seconds behind the world champion and Juliette Labous is third, two seconds behind the Danish rider. And tomorrow is the third stage in Italy. Thank you